thing that we're very proud of on this project is that it's a project that will help this region into the future, not only by providing mobility, but the median is wide enough to accept e -BART, the eBART extension into the future. So it's, it's planned, planned correctly. It's, we work together with our partners to make sure that that all works together. On behalf of the city of Brentwood, my council people and our leadership, I want to thank everybody that's in attendance, but also I want to thank whoever had the money. God bless you. You know, we had a ribbon cutting before. Uh, we're going to have ribbon cuttings again. And that just shows the hard work uh, and the cooperation between all these agencies, the Contra Costa Transportation Authority, the federal authority, uh, state authorities. In a sense, I've got the easy job. I just have to try and get federal money. Well, it's not that easy, but I'm glad to do it because it's so important for our community, for uh, just for their well-being, for the quality of life, but for the commerce of our, uh, of our community, uh, for the environment. All of these things come together. It wasn't easy to get the financing for these ambitious projects, but we pressed on, focused on finding, creating ways to make things happen so that we could fulfill our promises to the people of East County. Be it flying down south to make our case to the CTC, securing local funds to achieve our goal of reducing gridlock at this intersection, so we could stand today before a dream fulfilled, the Sand Creek Interchange. Really, it's about the economy, it's about jobs, it's about quality of life, and it's about safety. It's about getting from home to work and back to your family in a safe, efficient, and enjoyable manner. And the project here is a testimony to that. In the great effort between all the partners, uh, the CCTA staff, the CCTA board, uh, the partners within CCTA, the multiple jurisdictions, and their support staff, but most importantly, I'd like to recognize the construction team, the workers who are out there each and every day moving the dirt, built, pouring the concrete, putting the frames together, and making sure we actually have a project to point to and drive on that actually achieves and accomplishes the goals of everybody, the goals of the team. Thank you all for coming out today. Uh, there's been a lot of people thanked. I think one person, one group we haven't thanked yet is the voters of Contra Costa for continually supporting uh, the measures we put forth in the past, Measure C, Measure J, so that we can afford to continue to uh, build and expand and connect Contra Costa, which is exactly what we're doing here. Uh, every, every, every ribbon cutting is just an opportunity to uh, improve transportation efforts to make that make that trip a little bit quicker and a little bit easier. This project is a great example of what can be accomplished when a state, regional and local agencies partner and jointly develop, fund, construct critical transportation infrastructures. The greatest beneficiary of the success of our partnership is the community and the businesses served uh, by these improvements. Caltrans, Contra Costa Transportation Authority, the Metropolitan Transportation Commission, the, Co the California Transportation Commission, joint effort and collaboration on this and many other projects has not only helped in the great progress of the community is making here, but also provide greater success the growing businesses of this area, such as the streets of the Brentwood Shopping Center.